For $1,100, this brand new GE dryer just might draw you in with its large eight cubic foot capacity, as well as tons of dryer cycles and steam modes. But when you start to use it, you'll find it's pretty frustrating to operate. Unfortunately, it has a confusing control panel that has lots of clutter with buttons and lots of things going on, lots of diagrams, lots of text everywhere. It's just very complicated. You don't know exactly what you're supposed to be doing and what you're looking at. Even the lights around the control knob are very hard to see. They're small and they tend to wash out as well if you're looking off angle from the appliance. The performance of this dryer though is pretty rock solid. It does dry clothes relatively quickly and it also has a pretty nifty sensor that can detect the moisture level of the clothes and adjust the cycle time in real time. If share drying performance is what you're after above all for the price, then this is the dryer for you. If you're looking for a dryer that offers almost the same performance with a much better design and easier to use interface, then the Electrolux Perfect Steam 600 series is what you're looking for.